Employees at Vermeer Corporation in Pella say the tornado outbreak brought back memories. A tornado hit the plant in 2018, destroying buildings and flipping cars one on top of each other. Fortunately, no lives were lost that day. WHO 13's Stephanie Johnson explains why. July 19th, 2018 is a day Billy Fox will never forget. It was unlike any blue I had ever seen. Um, it was like a super vibrant turquoise blue. And the sounds. Just a low, constant sort of gurgle uh, sound for for about 15 minutes prior to the actual tornado hitting campus. But while the tornado was approaching, Billy says he kept an eye on the storm. And moments before the company was going to release hundreds of team members back to work, Billy made an important decision. Received some, some bad information that we could actually resume normal operations. And um, I made a decision that that would probably be a bad idea. And so, um, you know, we were, we're getting ready to sound an all clear uh, message to everybody to put everyone back to work uh, and I, I decided that we weren't going to do that. Next. And we kept everyone in shelter, thank God, because I think it was five or seven minutes later is when the tornado actually impacted uh, started to impact the north edge of our campus. The tornado ended up destroying more than 400,000 square feet of manufacturing space and damaged vehicles. However, no one was killed and the company credits Billy for the outcome. So you think about 3,500 team members in their shelter with his one command and that says everything that you need to know about Billy Fox. Just making it happen, keeping everyone safe and dedicated to what he does every day. We're, we're super fortunate, super blessed that, that that was the outcome. No matter the call that I made or didn't make, um, we're lucky that, that there were no fatalities and, and really just a couple minor. In, in Pella, Stephanie Johnson, WHO 13 News. You see how different the campus looks today. The company has built back more than 650,000 square feet.